Here's something that pretty much every person who's played VRChat in VR has experienced. If you go and you try to reach the ground in VR, in most avatars you can only get to about like shin height or so, and then you're hitting the physical floor. Now most people, myself included, thought that at first this was due to improperly setting up your settings in game and in like Steam VR. Now the real issue isn't to do with your in-game height settings or Steam VR calibration or anything like that. It's all about the avatars themselves. To explain more what I'm talking about, basically you have your two floors. Your real floor, where you're standing, and then your virtual floor, where your in-game character is standing. In most games, they're synced up perfectly and you can reach the ground and grab something. The way that VRChat tries to calibrate people, especially in like full body, is it has a height setting in the settings menu. When you set this, it scales the world bigger and smaller, but it's trying to scale it to your arm length. So for example, like for me, if I set the game to where my real height is five foot six, it will calibrate the game for my arm span because most VR users don't have full body and your arms are your best point of reference for your height. But most anime and cartoon avatars have an issue where their legs are super long and the arms to legs proportion just doesn't match up. So when the game calibrates the world to your arm length, but you're using a typical anime or cartoon avatar that has long legs, it scales the avatar and the world to your arms, but then you've got like all this extra leg length that doesn't match up in real life. So what the game does is it like sinks the virtual floor down. That way your legs aren't like crouched the whole time. The problem that this creates though is that if you go in real life and try to like pick something up off the ground, you hit the real floor before the virtual floor because your avatar's legs are just way too long. Now this avatar, when I started with the base, also had legs that were too long. Um, when I was editing it in Blender, I shortened the leg length so it's more proportionate to my real body. So that way I can, I can touch the floor, I can like accurately, um, it's my actual body proportions. So in this way it adds a lot to immersion and it's a little bit of work, but it does help a lot. But, but yeah, that's the reason why on a normal avatar with like long legs and such, you can't reach the floor and things just feel off. It's all to do with the avatar proportions and not your in-game settings. So I'll leave a link in the description to Kung's video, which has an in-depth tutorial how to fix your avatar proportions.